Hello. Hello. Alfred has sent us so many videos this time. But they're all really short, so we might compact this into one episode. Let's see. So, they're called the How It Should Have Ended series. Where they take and movies and say how they should have ended. This first one is Titanic. Oh, Titanic and me cry. Mm. Real men cry during movies like these, I swear, okay? Because trust me, this is a real man. Mm hmm. Alright. But Titanic, how Titanic should have ended. It's going to be interesting. Mm -hmm. Oi! Oh. Knock it off, you two! If you keep <laughs> making out like that, we're not gonna notice if any icebergs get too close. Hey. So that's how it happened. <laughs> oh, bollocks. You see what you bollocks. did? Jack, this is where we first met. Woman, we might die from this. I know. I just thought it was ironic or poetically tragic, baby. That guy just pinwheeled to his death. I know that. This is not poetic. This is real, Rose. Well, I was trying to make something horrible and sad feel beautiful. I'm sorry, Jack. You're on a lifeboat, and you jumped back onto a sinking ship. Are you insane? What is your problem? I did it because I want to be with you. We might die from this. Well, I'd rather freeze in the icy water if it means I can't be with you. It's really sweet, but something tells me I would have a better chance of survival if you would have just stayed on the lifeboat and let me figure out a way to float on my own. Now I'm going to have to find some wreckage and let you float on it, or else I'm a huge douchebag. Well, don't go out of your way or anything. We are on the tail of a sinking ship. I'm kind of stressed out right now. I don't think I like this side of you. Well, we did just meet like two days ago. It's about time we had our first argument. You know what I think? Maybe we should take some time apart from one another and cool our heads. Well, that should be easy. Because this water's gonna be freezing! Yeah. And that's what happened. Wow, that is a really interesting and long story. So, um, what? do you actually know where the diamond necklace is or not? You mean this necklace? <gasps> she has a necklace. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm just going to go throw this overboard into the ocean. <laughs> throw it overboard, that's funny. She's... Oh no, she's serious. Someone uh, grab her. Uh, are you real? Over here, fly, Grandma. I like that. Well then. I think it should have ended with him surviving, actually. So now we're going to the next one, which is Tangled. So you're just going to run through the forest with your hair dragging all over the place, huh? I can't believe I did this! You're not worried about stuff, I don't know, getting tangled in it? Um, oh, there goes a stick. There's a stick in your hair. And, and some leaves. leaves. A lot of leaves, actually. Is, is that a bird's nest? Oh Ew. This is getting gross. I don't know what that blood. is. Yeah. At least I hope that was that blood. Was blood? Oh, was it's that dead a dead animal? animal? You got a dead oh. animal in your hair. I think it was a squirrel. You don't even care? Nothing. Oh, no. Oh. Well, this is unfortunate. At first I thought you were kind of cute, and I was having second thoughts about stealing from you, but now I think... It's just fun. This is just sad. And you might be a little on the crazy side. Okay, this is getting weird. I'm just gonna go. You take Please care, Rapunzel. The ever! Alright, um... <laughs> that was right. now um, next. Now it's Hunger Games. I was five when I ruled my first kingdom. 
and spent years defending it with honor. Okay. Next, next is this one. There they are, this year's tributes, and what a fine bunch they are. Such excitement, such grace, and what, what is that? Well, it appears the odds aren't in their favor. <laughs> oh my god, he's still laughing. Hunger Games! Slight rule change regarding our previous rule change. The uh, previous rule change has been revoked. Uh, there can only be one, so uh, you must kill one another. What? You can't do that! Yeah, it's too late. We already won. You can't change the rules after the game is over. Stupid. Uh, yes, yes we can. Um, okay. You'll just have to kill each other. Now, uh, fight to the death. You fight to the death! Uh, it, it doesn't work like that. Um. Now, Less talking and more killing each other. What if we refuse to kill each other? Yeah, what do you think about that? Just fight to the death, please. We would rather commit suicide than kill each other. No. And you wouldn't let us do that. Please you don't. must have a victor, right? That's right. We'll pull a Romeo and Juliet. Oh, please don't tell me you think it should have ended with both of them uh, dying. Yes, because we are so in love. And we're gonna eat these berries if you don't let us both win. Uh, yeah. Uh, your eyes. Here we go. Fine. Go ahead. If you don't we see will. It. Do it then. Actually, we're see. gonna. Okay. We're waiting. One, two, three. Okay, okay, you got me. I don't really love him. What? <laughs> <laughs> he's in a box. He, he's a nice guy and all, but I'm not gonna commit suicide over it. I mean, Sorry. have you seen Gail? Hottie! I do like her and Gail together. And I like the music that they put in there. It sounds like something that keeps a lot of your peppers. Eh, it does. Wait, wait, there's something, there's something at the end of this. What's at the end? Hey, you guys ever think we should use all this money and technology to actually solve the world's problems? And world hunger, save the rainforest? No? Just me? We'd rather, uh, kids fight to the death? Okay. Just thought I'd ask. Alright then. And it's... Welcome everyone to Hogwarts School of right, Wizardry and Witchcraft. A place, I subscribe. assure you, is safe for children and has absolutely no history that might threaten our entire existence. But there is a huge killer snake downstairs. And a giant vicious three-headed dog. And a tree mm -hmm. that can kill you. And man-sized spiders that can eat your face. Thank and you, a... Professor Dumbledore. That will be all. <laughs> As he was <laughs> saying, <laughs> welcome to <laughs> these candles are dripping wax everywhere. <laughs> As he was no, how, how can they not? How can they not have all of that? I mean, I know it's all an illusion, but wax, you know. And they'll just spend about a levitation spell. That time turn is fantastic, Hermione. You should keep it forever. All right. No, really. It's too valuable. You have to promise to keep it. Okay, I promise. Hermione, something might conveniently destroy all the time turners, making that the last one. You've got to keep it. I promise I won't get rid of it. What the bloody hell are you talking about? <laughs> Why are they, like, looking at me like this? Hmm. So, so, much, so much death at the end of these. Headwigs, that was pretty sad. 
my dummy. Oh, I cried. Oh, Snape. I'm going to kill you, Harry Potter! I'm pointing my wand as hard as I can! What is it gonna take, Tom? You tried to kill me once as a baby and it didn't work! I'm going to destroy you! We've beaten you like four or five times already, and I just came back from the dead! La 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 la, I'm not listening, too busy about to kill you! You are insane! And now we're about to kill your pet snake! <laughs> Over. Under, it's under no over! No more Wait. Snape? Ah, Snape. Weapon. Professor Snape, you're alive! Of course I'm alive, you twit. But how? You died right in front of us! Magic? Duh. I'm a potions master and a double agent. Obviously I had a backup plan. I've been drinking honey badger anti-venom ever since I started hanging around that ridiculous snake. Honey badger. Whoa. Honey badger just takes what it wants. And I think we've already established that I can heal bleeding injuries. Now, Mr. Potter, if you will bring me your invisibility cloak and Miss Granger's time turner, there is one more thing I must do. Professor, you realize if you do this, you can't come back. I am well aware of the risk and consequence, Miss Granger. You're gonna have to turn that thing at least 200,000 times, sir. Then you best not make me lose count, eh, Mr. Weasley? No, sir. Good luck, sir. Goodbye, children. One, two, three, four, five, six. Huh? 262,030. 262,031. Got it! Got it! Oh, the orphanage! I can make animals do what I want, but I'm training them. I can make bad things happen to people. If I want. I can make. Oh! <laughs> what is this? Take that, you dark lord! <laughs> Why would you do that? Evidence. Removal. <laughs> who, who are you? Oh, sorry about that. Just, uh, saving your life in the future, as well as countless others. It's a long story. That is like the whole thing has been changed. Everything's been like changed. a really long story. Like so long, if we wrote it all down, it would take up at least seven books. Hey. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, movies. I'd like to introduce our new teacher for Defense Against the Dark Arts, Professor Gandalf. You shall <laughs> not pass! Well, that's a little harsh. Classes haven't even started yet. <laughs> All right, now those were amusing. I like those. Uh, Alfred, okay. send us more of those. Send, send, send us more. I, I like those. Uh, uh, see. Uh, I'd, I'd actually like if you had um a couple more movies, like uh, what are some of the ones that. Not the Rings! I think if Rise of the Guardians had a different Ooh. ending, that would be cool. That would be. I think Gilbert would go crazy if they did that, though. <laughs> mm hmm. And maybe See, a couple of Disney, Disney movies. Like. I mean, yeah. The only thing do. is that Dick Frost has blue eyes. And he... And has magic. They're so, they're so similar, you know? They're both so egotistical. See. But, anyways, that's what and we're then, talking and about. And this is what that reminds me a lot of Tooth Fairy. Eh, to a point. Um, my brother reminds me a lot of the Easter Bunny, though. Jack. Steve? Jack. No, wait, you're Jack. talking about his name is Steve. No, it's Jack. Oh, okay. Why are you thinking that my brother's <laughs> name is Steve? My god. An, Aus an Australian named Steve. What are you talking about? Steve Irwin. Oh, yeah, but. Oh my god, you're making me sound like an idiot. But anyways, I'm Arthur. <laughs> I'm Isabella. And. Adios! Farewell. Farewell.